Cheers, bottoms up, pinkies up. What is up? Today we are gonna be talking about what to do when things do not go your way. If you are here, then you are alive to vibe and I want to welcome you to the tribe. I'm Sally Tetley and at this channel, we're going to be talking about all things spirituality, mindset, or we can just be hanging out here, sitting, vibing out like two best friends, soul brothers and sisters, having a good time. Okay, let me tell you guys why I am sitting here with you today talking about this topic instead of what I had originally planned because things did not go my way and that is okay. What I was going to post was a video about the third eye and whether it was demonic or if it was biblical and I was connecting all of the different cultures and religions related to the third eye and I was just so amped up I was like all right baby let's go love and light we tearing up the matrix <laughs> so I spent a good chunk of my day recording and then everything and my camera started randomizing. I didn't know what was what. I was with online support for like a whole hour or so. I couldn't import anything onto my laptop. My batteries weren't charging. And this was after I had waited weeks for my brand new faulty camera to get fixed. I had also gone through a series of tests previously before my first video and that was a huge lesson for me during that time because I was going through a lot of the similar issues that I was having except tons more. I was on the phone with Tiara from Apple Support. Shout out to Tiara! If you find this video, I was on the phone with her and I was telling her, you know what, I don't think this is for me. Like maybe the universe doesn't want me to go on with this. Maybe I'm guided to a different direction. And then she said, no, the universe is testing you to see how committed you are. And that challenges come to you to see if you are going to give up. I was shooketh. I was shooketh to the core because it was like the universe was speaking through her to me and I knew she was right. I, I knew it. When I decided to keep moving, I looked at the clock and then guess what? 333 three, three, baby, divine confirmation. I remember back in high school, back in college, I used to be a straight A student, 3.92 magna cum laude. So when I found out that it was a test, I said, bring it on. I'm gonna do everything I can to ace it, even when I'm this tired. <laughs> Because mama ain't raised no loser. No, I'm gonna pass with flying colors. The warrior spirit in me is not giving up. I'm gonna stand my ground. I'm gonna find a way. As soon as things didn't go my way, I was like, Damn, all right. Let's get hydrated. Let's go outside. Let's come back with a new game plan. Instead of freaking out about the deadline or throwing a fit, 
about either having to start over or make changes to my plans, I was like, yes, because this was a chance for me to step into the traits that I wanted to embody. I realized that I had been asking God to show me how I am adaptable, show me how I am resilient, show me how I am perseverant and persistent and consistent and determined, show me how, show me how, show me how, ask and it is delivered ask and it is given and oftentimes it is given in trials and tribulations and even if we didn't ask when we know who we want to be we see each moment as an opportunity to rise to rise think about it how can you show your adaptability and your resiliency when things do not go as planned i can now make the choice to be resilient to be adaptable and for that i feel gratitude for this opportunity and with gratitude i am always given grace I can now work any situation with ease. I can see the lessons clear as day. And although the situation was particularly light, I know that I can apply this lesson, this way of thinking to anything that comes my way. And for that, I feel grateful. Because with this grace, I can do anything. Everything would have gone easy peasy, smooth sailing, but it didn't. So I trust that there is a divine reason for everything. Even if it is resonant to just one person, I'm still going to be like, hey, I did my thing, I did my thing. <laughs> The universe, God, our higher selves, throw us these curveballs and it's up to us if we are gonna get served or if we're gonna use that to serve. When things don't go my way, it's okay, it's okay. I trust in the divine and surrender to the process and know that everything is meant to be and that it is done for me and not to me. And when I see that it is a gift from the universe, I can then re-gift my experience to you. Y'all my tribe, all 39 of y'all, we are live to vibe. Like, comment, and subscribe. Hey. I make videos every Thursdays and Sundays. That's because I am dedicated to walking alongside you back home within yourself, within ourself. We together are gonna pass this earth school. Alright, so fam, I will see you in the next video.